Production studios are changing radically in terms of their uh, infrastructure. They are no longer point-to-point -point based with patch bays and cross connects and distribution amps. They are now network based where every device plugs into the network and you can transmit video information from one device to another device by simply changing a routing table, typically through a web-based interface. In a traditional production studio, they use what is called point-to-point -point wiring topology. What that means is that if they want to connect a camera in Studio A1 they can, uh, to a switcher in Control Room 1, they run a cable between the two. Now, in most production studios, they'll use what's called a patch panel. They'll connect all the outputs from Studio 1 into the upper part of this patch panel, and they'll connect all the inputs to the switcher to the lower part of this patch panel. So if they want to connect uh, camera 1 to switcher 1, what they'll do is they'll go to the patch panel, they'll find Studio 1, Camera 1. They will then put a patch card in there. Then they'll go to Control Room 1, Switcher 1, Input 1, and they'll patch that cable into that port. So now Camera 1 is directly plugged into Input 1 of Switcher 1 in the Control Room. A common scenario in a production studio is that you might want to be able to share the camera that is in Studio 1 with the switcher that's in Control Room 2. And so in order to do this, the first thing we'd do is we'd find the, in, the output of the camera, Studio 1, Camera 1. We would find that patch cord and we would remove the patch cord. Then we would find the input in Studio in Control Room 2, so Control Room 2, Switcher 2, input to, and we would simply attach, uh, plug, we would patch a cable from one to the other. So now camera one shows up on switcher two in control room two. The drawback of this scenario is that control room one no longer is using that camera. Me, me, me. Okay. Now if you actually want to be able to use the camera in both studios, you have to add a piece of equipment to the patch panel, what's called a distribution amplifier. A distribution amplifier takes an input and then amplifies it and redirects it to a series of outputs that you can plug different devices into. You can plug into different devices. So the distribution amp is here. We would take the camera in Studio 1, Studio 1, Camera 1. We would then patch that to the input of the distribution amp. Then we would take the uh, input to switcher one, uh, control room one, switcher one, input one. We would find that and we would patch that into the first uh, output. Then we would take the input from switcher two, we would take control room two, switcher two, input two. We would find that on the patch panel and we would pack that into the second output of the distribution amp. So now, both studios can use the same camera simultaneously. Now, the drawback with point-to-point -point wiring is that when you need, want to make a change, you either have to repatch something, or sometimes you have to insert equipment like distribution amps. This also could be a cross-connect switch, or a, uh, for a, a distribution switcher, uh, different devices that do sort of the same thing. This is the way a traditional uh, wiring infrastructure for a traditional uh, production studio works.